Chris Samantha, Joe Roth. Samantha, what are the uh, chances that Biden has in a swing state like Florida? Well, Chuck, it's finally official. Joe Biden, one of the most recognizable names in politics, is jumping into the 2020 presidential race, joining a very crowded field of Democratic candidates, all vying for the Democratic nomination. But can Biden, with 20 other contenders, win in a complex swing state like Florida? Well, Biden, 76 years old, is already setting his sights on the Sunshine State. He's differentiating himself from other candidates immediately released. Spanish language advertising. The ad filmed in South Florida indicates how seriously Biden intends to court the Latino vote, a critical voting bloc in the state that exceeds 16 percent and a major part of the electorate in other early states like Nevada and California, which has recently moved up its primary to March 3rd. The big question is, can Biden defeat President Trump in the general election? Now, experts think he has a shot, but he has to get through a pretty bruising primary process to get there. We did just have a sort of Joe Biden style candidate in Bill Nelson in Florida, and he ended up not winning. I will say that Biden as sort of a maybe not necessarily moderate uh, on the overall political spectrum, but is closer to the center, I guess, than many of the other Democrats. That is usually the kind of Democratic candidate that Democrats have sort of preferred in Florida. Now, Biden has received a very warm reception from Florida voters during a visit in late October while he was rallying for former Senator Bill Nelson and other Democrats. Now, Steve Shale, who has helped uh, former President Obama, leading him to two victories in the state, will serve as a senior advisor to Biden. But California Senator Kamala Harris has already secured the former president's top fundraiser in the state. So it appears that the former VP has his work cut out for him in a very long primary process ahead. We're live on Capitol Hill this afternoon. Samantha Jaroth, Spectrum, Bay News 9.